Well, that may have destroyed the usefulness of it. I don't think it can see deer clops. Well, I think we could just make another eye turret and we'd have a fairly fair test because I don't think uh, it targeted. I guess if you build a wall around it or grass, he can't, it can't steam. Now, again, this is test, so that may change. Okay, you big stinky. You got him. I don't know, that one's not targeting him. Maybe he counts as a neutral mob until he attacks. Oh hell, am I in the attack zone? We're back, Wilson. Sorry, I was drinking a soda. Get off me, you fat rat. Ha ha. I have an answer for you. Is this the third one? Get him eyeball. Get him eyeball. Darn. Well, that was three. Now, giving it some... I don't know. It didn't seem to attack him until he attacked it. So, I don't know if giving it some distance would have helped it. Yeah, he just uh, kicking the snot out of those. So the earlier testing, uh, we got a false positive because uh, there were so many attacking him. There we go, dead deer clops. The other thing, I don't recall the video I it was in a Wilson video I don't know how many people saw it but since we're being silly uh, I've thought about just doing some uh, little code silliness but I'm always doing more realistic things and uh, I don't know if people would want to watch it it seems to me like something anybody else could do anytime they wanted to anyway I don't know if you need me for it alright what happened was the deer clops fought each other Either that or it's a really disgusting, disturbing mating dance they perform. Here's the Republicans and Democrats in Congress. I'm right. No, I'm right. I'm right. Uh, I'm right. I will foil your attempts to <laughs> improve the lot of the American people. No, I will foil your attempts to improve the lot of the American people. <laughs> your mother, your father, your sister, your brother. Yeah, bite me, big boy. Uh, I can't resist. Ha ha. Okay, that's uh. Ah, the high question came up uh, about the wall. Now I've only checked the wall on this uh, with uh, deer clops. Let's see. And uh, Widget did not target him. The eye turret, minnow clopper, whatever. Minnow clopper, I don't know. Minnow clopper is one of those 
not very happy phrases. The question was, this thing attacking them, could you protect it with a wall? Also, and it doesn't seem to shoot past walls at this present time. So yes, you can protect it with against the wall with a wall, but it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't take advantage of the protection. And that's what it did with the deer clops. I thought maybe it was just the deer clops. been able to get it to attack my enemies or anything, so I don't know if there's some bonding ritual where we share blood or bodily fluids or there might be something I'm missing, but uh, they seem rather stupid. And there was something, oh, it was uh, in the uh, one video I went upstairs, or I mentioned I'd gone upstairs and came back down and my friend Night. Let me uh, turn this down a little bit. I was uh, laying down for a while and my head's not completely together. But anyway, I went upstairs and the knight and the bishop that I had repaired out of junk piles uh, were no longer my friends and attacked me. And somebody asked, do you think that might be a bug because this is test? And it's like, I think this might be test and it might be changed. Hello. <laughs> I've never said it. everything that's in test is going to turn up in the game. And as far as trying to figure out if something's, uh, you know, there's three different Chesters. There's a Chester in the real world, a Chester in the first level of caves, and a Chester in the second level of caves. And they all have different items in them. So the idea that something you've befriended is no longer your friend isn't a surprise to me at all. But as far as I have, you know, I've never said in any video that everything that's in test is going to be in the game because it's not. I hope I wasn't uh, <laughs> unclear on that subject. So anyway, I don't see any point in the walls for, I don't know. Um, as I said, after after test is over, maybe that'll be the coolest thing in the world is, is turrets inside a... inside of uh, walls or maybe they need to be closer but there's a limit to how much time I'm, there's a limit to how much time I want to spend on a mechanism that uh, may not even go into the game I mean I'm sure I turrets will but as far as in this format I, I have no idea Dogs do keep themselves entertained, don't they? There's one next door to people. Yeah. <laughs> Dog's fine. He's not mistreated or anything, but the people go away all damn day and they come over to the fence and he's going crazy all day long and they come over to the fence, they say hi to him when they get home and then they go in the house and it's like, oh, well, that was nice. <laughs> <laughs> uh, ah, there you go. The closer walls, it went for it. So there you go. The difference of day, Max. Well, let's give you a hound mound to play with then. That's why when somebody sends me something and says they've tested it, I always like to know them over a period of time. It's one reason I always respected people like uh, uh, Ghost Flames and Crazy Paper Mask Dude and several other people that I will not think of right at this moment. What was, if they said they tested something, you knew they actually had.
you? Where's my light? Alright, you need another, let's, well, let's go ahead and make another one. I kind of hate to do it that way, but. It seemed to me like, right, there's a hound. It seemed to me like it didn't go after it. Yeah, see, it's not attacked there when it attacked the wall. So I'd say depending on how you have your walls made. Uh, the Tam, if you don't know, is level 2, uh, winter gear. And, uh, Wilson's beard, uh, helps with a lot of stuff. Yeah, it doesn't do it until it attacks the wall. So it would be a matter of the construction at this point, as far as in the future, I don't know. They are my merms. Now, you guys have been out before dust. Oh, do they not? I don't think they come out in winter. Well, fudge, fudge hammers and pickles. I guess we're stuck with dogs. Yeah, see, it's totally ignoring him there. Yeah, I think those were hits. That's the... Kind of hard for me to tell. I'm not one of the world's great experts on testing. I usually mention that. Yeah, for whatever it's worth, that's the end of it for me. They're through the wall now anyway. There was also some thought about putting uh, grass. I don't know if I can get rid of... See, I had grass. Oops, we'll freeze our ass off with that on. Um, oh, it won't be grown enough, I think. I don't... Don't die on me, I turret. I pie whack it. Well, anyway, like I said, it'll probably change one way or the other, especially with people commenting on it in forums. So... Thank you. 
Seems like there ought to be a way to take advantage of their AI pathing, but I can't think of it offhand. And see, I've got no idea if it repairs itself over time or, you know, bunnies do. Uh, no clue. And it may not do anything either way on that subject yet. Come on, pilot. Daddy, use the computer, please. Please. I'm bored of watching this thing do this. So anyway, if I didn't uh, round things out, that's uh, it for two. Oh, you know, I did the worm. And uh, like I said, the worm isn't on this update. Kevin said it wasn't ready yet and made a joke about it. So, and I think it's... Uh, I think it's very likely has something to do with it not being able to find a, an active area. So anyway, and I didn't find the, uh, what you call it, it's the Nightmare Nights. And I don't know, I can't think offhand how to go about that. So, all right, you all take care of yourselves and uh, I'll be around.